Hello everybody, this is the Deeple module for Odoo version 2. In version 2, we've attempted to offer multiple products and multiple variants and multiple language scripts, language strings to be translated all at once. So this gives this gives a necessary functionality for large websites and large shops to basically go for uh, a multi-select um, kind of operation for your translations. So what I've got here is as a test setup, I've got under sales and go into uh, products and product translations and you reach the translations menu. You can select the products over here. I've just made for the sake of this recording uh, uh, a, a pre-selection of group my uh, language strings by language and I have selected particularly one particular string that's the uh, pertaining to the product called customizable desk. It's kind of look like this in the front end and we'll, um, we'll, we'll focus our test on this particular product. So as a filter, you can also have the untranslated um, strings. So I have eight untranslated strings in French. Keep an eye on that. And we can go into the translations now. So what I'm going to take first is I'll explain uh, uh, to quickly explain the, the columns that we have here. This is the product name. This is the field name. This itself cannot be translated. Uh, that's a system field. This is the internal source. So the sales description for for customizable desk is like this. It's 160 by um, what, uh, by 80, and this this is a string. As we see, the translation value is null because we have filtered only for untranslated strings. Uh, if we remove that filter, we can see that there are also other strings which have translations and for them. The language is the French, and this is a preview column. So when I click the translate button, which we would, it's lo it's going to load. It's going to bring a preview. Now this one has to be saved. So the translation value is still empty. We just made a call to Deeple. We'll make another call to Deeple and get the preview as a translation. Now in order to save these, just click on save, and our number of untranslated terms also gets up, updated. Those are still single translations, single string translations, but the highlight of this release of the Deeple Odoo module is multi-select. So I'm going to take three, the, three of these products or two of these products, since I've got only six here, I'm going to go into the action menu and click on translate all products. And lo and behold, we've got that translation through as well. So in order to check for our customizable desk, let's check on the front end if we have actually in the French language, we are already in the French language, but the translation for the uh, sales description seems to be in English. So if we reload this page or change the language to a desired language that we want to test and we're, still, we're already there, we should see the French translation in here, which we just created, which we just achieved or, or uh, accomplished. Let's go to the Dutch um, language and see what the situation is here. We have an English string over here. Probably we're going to find the Dutch uh, sales description field as um, in English and the translation value is nothing here. I'm going to select and perform the same procedure. Um, the number of product, number of trans, number of strings has reduced and re refreshing this page should give us a Dutch string over here. So this is how the the translations and the multi translations work. I've been a bit selective for the sake of this this um, uh, demo or the or or video. Uh, if you remove all these, you can you would normally see in the Odoo database that there's just four uh, uh, an, a relatively small number of products. So I've got forty two products here. Um, I have ten thousand strings in all languages all sorts of strings, variants, the main products, etc. So at the beginning, as you test this tool out, it might be a little bit overwhelming to navigate through all the strings that Odoo stores in the database, but we made it possible to actually um, translate all of these strings very, very, uh, very quickly, very rapidly. Uh, Multi-selects, um, you know, take a reasonable value, select, you know, something like 50 products or 60 products or 50 or 60 strings at once. That's still okay if you select all 10,000 on the other extreme. Um, you'll probably have a timeout on the API of 
people or a timeout um, while receiving the responses on the other side just unexpected things might happen so just uh, make your make your uh, make your tests as well as productive usage scenarios somewhat toned down somewhat lightweight you might just have to click it a few times um, but that's still overseeable so enjoy the module and uh, we are happy to receive your feedback and the module is for sale just write back to us by email or or any other way uh, linkedin etc and we're happy to send you the module and um, and help you out from there as well if you need support with installation. Thank you.